Zwom. Bimo. Hello, everyone, and welcome to another Bimo Creative Crypto video. This one is about the Hal Malak or Fisher Pig. The Fisher Pig or Swamp Pig is a cryptid pig reported from Hungary, said to have died out by the 1880s or 1890s, but it's supposed to be a prehistoric animal, but sightings have happened in 1880s and 1890s. It was described as a very big animal with a curved back, which lived in large herds in the marshes around the rivers Tiza and Koros, witnessed feeding on crabs, fish, instead of vegetation. An artist by the name of Oros Itzvan, a Hungarian painter, printmaker, graphic designer, and animated film director that is known for his mathematically inspired works, impossible objects, optical illusions, double meaning, images, and anamorphoses, was one of the first to openly mention this traditional belief in uh, fisher pigs to the attention of crypto investigators all over the world as recently as 2016. Although he said it feels as if it is likely just a local variety of wild boar, the size and description of this thing, yeah, clearly says otherwise. This is the size of the fisher pig. Not a wild boar. Others suggested that they have been, uh, or maybe they are, feral domestic pigs. Zoologists note that boars and pigs are known to inhabit swamps and marshes and even eat fish and marine invertebrates. However, the question is why such a familiar species, if that is what they, if it is actually what they say it is, would be considered a separate animal by local shepherds and fishermen that have seen this thing in the area. A less plausible theory, according to science, that I totally believe is probably what this thing is, is that they are or were surviving intelligents, another of several prehistoric animals science has written off to extinction millions of years ago. Also called hell pigs or terminator pigs by pop culture, these things really look more like a mix between a hippo and a buffalo and are probably related to hippos and not pigs at all. After all, it seems unlikely that such a conspicuous creature could have survived into modern times in Europe without having attracted very appreciable sustained attention from support from sport hunters, for example, um, for whom they would have made, uh, I don't know, trophies mounted on walls, heads to be displayed proudly in hunting lodges, country estates and restaurants across the continent, and yet no mountain heads or any specimens seemingly exist. None at least have been brought to public notice. But as difficult as it is to understand in America, it's, it's a Western thing. It's a Western cultural thing to show off trophies and rooms full of trophies and heads and things to strangers and blab about all this stuff in social media and to everyone who will listen in other parts of the world possibly like hungary if you did hunt or kill or eat or mount the head of one of these maybe you wouldn't just tell everyone because why make a spectacle of yourself it's not positive in other countries to bring authoritative attention to yourself to hunt animals illegally or on natural reserves after all. So, what do you all think? Could yet another prehistoric animal have survived far past what science thinks is long enough? I think so. Anyways, that's gonna do it for this one guys. Thanks so much for watching. Please go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and tell me what you think about the uh, Fisher Pig We'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye.